All right, so this app crashed. There was a candle burning here. And the thing has burned out. And, uh, so everything is gonna be screwed up in this video. Okay, pretend that the candle is burning here and lighting is screwed in this video, right? That's what we're gonna do. Okay, hi. My name is Somadi, you spoke on another video, right? So in this one, I'm going to do a quick one, a breakdown of a recent reel I did on my Instagram, right? So this thing I've done uh, two years ago, right? Uh, it's very simple for me, but in the interest of like having my audience know my capabilities, right? Because most people don't know um, that I'm, I'm an editor and not a bad one, right? Because of been doing this thing for a while uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my last reel right the one where I, I changed through a box right and then tell you or show you how I edited the thing right you need me then 30 seconds damn First things you need to note uh, with doing this video is you need three shots, right? But the most important thing is you place your camera or your phone or whatever you're recording with in a stable spot. You do not move it. If it's your phone, make sure auto lock is disabled. You don't touch your phone while recording, right? Excuse. So here's what you need. You need three shots. The first shot is a blank shot of whatever space you'd be using, which for me was that space, right? It was just blank, nothing happening, uh, nothing moving. That's the face, first shot, right? Second shot is uh, the shot of me just going there and saying, uh, what did I say? Uh, oh, I'm needed in 30 seconds. Then I take the box, get on it. Or have the box go down on me uh, that's what she said but take the box and like press the box have it go down like that right man okay then when it goes down like that why the noise okay when it goes down like that right you move out of the box make sure it, it doesn't move right and you don't touch it as you move out right then i went and changed the clothes right put on other clothes then i went into the box and then took it up and then out right so the important things you need to note here so when you're taking the box uh, when it's going down uh, make sure that your hands you just put the box in and your hands don't touch the box as much as possible right especially on the upper parts so that uh, the next step is easier you don't touch the box as it's going down just put it in and then have it go down on you on its own right and as it's moving up make sure you don't touch the box on the corners i made that mistake here although i had planned not to make it right you take the box from inside you touch it inside right not uh, outside just in move it up somehow or below move it up and then out right this is so that the, the next step is easier the next step is called masking i've talked about it uh, some people know it as cropping in photography mode just because i'm recording with the phone i need to check if this thing is recording because this is my second time and i would hate to do this thing for the third time okay it was still recording okay so what you do is uh, you crop right or mask what you do with masking is uh, you place these clips in this way the first layer of your clips is the um, one with the blank shot right when nothing is happening nothing is moving make sure the light doesn't change everything remains the same right and then the second shot the one on top of that is gonna be the one where you're dressing the box going down right and then what you do is as soon as the box goes uh, into your head you make sure your head doesn't come out the other way how do you make sure of that 
you do what is called masking right so you mask uh, frame by frame right frame by frame so what we do with the mask essentially is you are making a hole in a video right so if you're going frame by frame you're making a hole and you're making it bigger and bigger and bigger so if the box goes down the hole gets bigger and bigger and bigger so what you do with the hole someone needs to fill this hole up right so what fills this hole up is the the first clip the one that is a blank shot where nothing is happening that footage goes behind this one to fill up this space right that's why i said you needed light to not change right and then as that happens as the box goes down and then hits the bottom what you do is you cut as it hits the bottom and it moves up right cut to the clip where you're taking the box up now and then you do the same thing as well you crop or mask the top layer or the upper part of your body and reveal it as the box goes up right here the box moved up out uh, uh, remove the mask uh, completely right then you you go on with whatever the plan of the footage is right and then the other things that you need to note i need to check if this thing's still recording man 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 i hate doing this i hate having to stop a video while i'm flowing like that man uh, okay so the other important thing that you need to do uh after you've done those things after i've edited the you might find that the colors are not the same like the, the footage something changed right but you need to make sure that it's fixed it's, it makes the whole process easier make sure that the white balance is fixed if you're using a professional camera or the professional professional apps in your phone white balance is fixed uh, iso is fixed the frame rate is fixed makes the whole thing uh, much more easier or shutter speed not frame rate right makes the whole thing easier but if there are problems you do what is called color uh, what color correction correct the colors of each clip so that they match and everything looks the same right if you are lazy to do that you can just have the whole clip be black and white I think you might still have problems with exposure there but that will eliminate most of the issues right so after you've done that to add a layer of confusion and the layer because here you're making an illusion right so you're trying to trick people you can add a fake camera motion like it must look like the camera was handheld right these there must be some mobiness some movement that goes on so there are presets you can find them online easily to fake camera movement right so that whatever mistakes you make they can't be easily detected because there is that uh, shake to the footage as well and just a little bit right and then yeah that is all uh, that's important they put on the music and whatever that you need to put in after that you export the clip then everything is fine Hopefully I explained this thing well. Uh, if you have any questions or any parts that are unclear, leave them up in the comment section below, right? And if you like this video, you need to like it. I think this is how uh, channels are grown, are grow, are grown, right? So I'll need at least five, five likes. Let's see how you guys do. Five likes on this video. Uh, share this video with whoever you feel might need it or might help them in whatever way okay this has been going on for too long uh this has been it so my thing is see i'll talk to you in the next one peace